So you might be wanting to go ahead and change how your notifications are being displayed on your iPhone 14 Pro. Now your older notifications are still going to come up here as most of you know, but if you don't like the stack or you don't like how your notifications are currently showing up, well you can go ahead and change this within your iPhone. So what you want to do is you want to basically go inside of your settings application. So go and click on the settings as you normally would. And what you want to do here is you want to scroll down until you see notifications, which is right here. So now what you want to do is you want to click on notifications and you'll come into this panel. Now you'll see at the very top, you'll see a few different things. So you'll see count, you'll see stack, and you'll see a list. Now the stack is pretty much probably what you already have. So what you want to do is you probably want to convert it to probably the list. Now the list is probably something what you want to do. Personally, I kind of like having the stack method. It seems better, it looks better in my opinion, but that is one option that you have here. Now your notifications will now start coming off at the bottom. So some of you may not like that. With the notifications coming at the bottom, it's okay, I, I mean, the top portion is basically for other widgets because you have widgets up here and other things. But what you can always do is within here, you can always go ahead and scroll down and you can kind of customize how these type of notifications are enabled on your phone. So if under messages, you can see, you can have, you know, the lock screen method, you can have notification center, you can have banners, you can go ahead and disable all these types of notifications as well. So that's another thing you can do within your phone, which is really, really cool. You always have the option at home. I mean, you have a lot of other ways to customize your notifications too. But if you don't like those stack notifications, you can always convert them to list or count, and that's pretty much how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button on me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.